Hey, this is Brandon Dixon from Passive Total. Today I wanted to show off the MISP integration that we have. MISP is an open source sharing platform that allows you to store your indicators and also create events and associate those indicators to them. What we like about this integration is that it allows our users to essentially share information about threats directly with other users of MISP platforms. So one of the features that's nice is when you first power up MISP, you can subscribe to the public feeds that are available uh, in the main primary MISP server. So what we have here is a bunch of events that have been created, um, either marked TLP white or marked as uh, open source intelligence. If we were to dive into one of these, let's say the power sniff malware, what we'll see is a bit of information about the actual event itself, and then we'll get a table of all the indicators associated with it. Now, there's a lot of information here. MISP has the ability to store details about files, network data, uh, financial information, and then like other proposed changes from users. And then of course the ability to kind of correlate all the events that are available inside the system. With the Passive Total integration, we wanted to try and take all of the data that we had at Passive Total and bring it in to a MISP event. So the way that this works is once you install the Passive Total plugin into MISP, you'll see this small little asterisk noted, uh, on each of the items where in, uh, a module can actually run. So if I wanted to, I could select all of these domains associated with this event and then click on that asterisk button. And what it's going to do is it's going to ask me which expansion module or enrichment module do I want to choose. And in this case, we're going to choose passive total. Now, while that's loading, you know, our philosophy here was to try and load as much data as possible. So we have passive DNS, who is information, open source intelligence, malware, host trackers, Basically, anything that you find inside of our API will be available inside this integration. So now we have a set of results. You can see here that we got a couple IP addresses that came from the uh, passive DNS. We have some external analysis URLs with virus total and some research from Palo Alto through networks. And these are links that were collected from our open source intelligence. If we continue scrolling down, we got a bunch of hashes that show uh, SHA-256. So this came from our malware repository. And if we wanted to, uh, we could go in and actually adjust the comment on each of these indicators um, and change you know, the properties to them. But if we wanted to accept it as is, we could say submit. And what's going to happen is all of these items will now be added to the event itself. And what's nice about this is that, like I said before, MISP allows users the ability to kind of propose changes to events and then share them back out with the larger community. We view this as a pretty powerful capability. We think it's pretty awesome. And as you start to use this uh, inside of MISP, if you have any additional features that you'd like to see or any comments, please feel free to send us a message over at PassiveTool.org. Thank you.